Hello my eye catchers. Today we'll be finding out what people are wearing in London's Soho, what their star sign is and whether there's any correlation between the two. This video is only for entertainment purposes though. I'll do more in-depth analyses in the future so subscribe if that's your jam. Okay, let's go. So the coat is shrimps, the bag is Chloe, my, the leather trousers are vintage, shoes are docks and all the rings and everything are great frog. And your glasses? Uh, or glasses are polo. What's your star sign? Uh, Virgo, which is apparently like excessive everything and yes. apparently I get that a lot. I am told I look like a Virgo. I would say so. I like that, I like that. I do have a, I have a tattoo saying Virgo as well, so very cool. it's yeah. very Virgo. Beyonce is Virgo. Very all the good people are Virgos. All the good people are Virgos. <laughs> so this lady here is wearing a lot of earthy tones throughout her outfit. So she has various brown shades in her coat, in her tortoiseshell glasses, as well as in her bag. And actually, Virgo's lucky colour is said to be brown. It's it's also interesting that Virgos usually love fashion and are super on trend, just like this gorgeous lady here. As far as I can tell, all the pieces, apart from the vintage pieces obviously, are from this current season. Are you doing anything fun today? Uh, no, just I think we're working late this evening so it'll be a good day. Thank you so much for your time. Pleasure, Enjoy. thank you so much. Have a good day. The treasure and the boost um, from Rick Owens and uh, this from, oh, I, I bought it from China. Unfortunately, I couldn't find out what a star sign is. Um, the language barrier was just too big. If I had to guess, I'd probably say Aries because he looks really bold and super self-confident. Doing anything fun today? Uh, I'm going to look around and uh, maybe going shopping. Uh, so today I'm wearing some second-hand uh, earrings that my friend got me. Um, some charity shop necklaces, a t-shirt that belonged to my dad, a shirt from Topshop, <laughs> um, and a trader's leather jacket from a vintage market. Um, I'm not sure what these jeans are. My socks are actually Primark. Primark socks, um, nice. yeah, some new rock. So today I was just going to put some mascara on, then I got a bit carried away. What's your star sign? My star sign, Leo. Fire sign. Yes. <laughs> because of the socks. <laughs> the socks. <laughs> Would you say that you dress like Leo? Um, maybe yeah. 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 Leo is a fire sign and its lucky colour is said to be orange, which happens to coincide with this chap's socks. Leos like to stand out and this one definitely does. He made me think of Mick Jagger in his younger years. You know, the leather, the makeup, the rock and roll and out there-ness. Gonna go to an art exhibition and then gonna go to a Klein concert at night. Yeah. Thank you so much for your time. No worries. <laughs> Thank you. Um, this is from Cancer Research in Reading. This is also from a charity shop, Sue Ryder in Reading. I got this from Age Concern and my tights are from Primark and my boots are Doc Martens from eBay. So this is from Shoreditch Market, where, do you remember the name of that? I can't one, remember. One of the ones, Underground Market. Um, this is a Chloe from eBay. eBay mesh situation, um, Adidas, velvety, top of the tracksuit. These are charity shop as well, so not sure where they're from, but a cool find. And then work boots, shoes in, classic. What's your star sign? Capricorn. Capricorn. Aquarius. Would you say you're dressed like your star sign? Um, no. My star sign is very grounded and <laughs> behaved, and I don't think my style yeah. says that. <laughs> Already. I think Aquarius, flowy, creative, yeah. You're wearing quite, you know, watery colours. Yeah, so yeah. Like they're more actually an air sign, but I always um, associate Aquarius with blue and green. I yeah, agree. I agree. I was definitely surprised that the lady in red is Capricorn. I suspect that her ascendant is probably something quite rebellious, like Aries or Scorpio. Um, we're actually on our way back from a party. We've not been to bed yet. <laughs> <laughs> So, well, thank you so much for stopping. No and worries. Enjoy your day. Thank, thank you. Thank you. Hey. Hi. 
You look amazing. What are you wearing today? Thank you. I'm just wearing a Nike duffel coat, my favorite jeans, which actually are from a local store that I go when I go back home in Italy. And it's a niche brand. She's Comme des Garçons play for Converse and Arquette leather bag. My star sign is Gemini. Gemini, very cool. Yeah. Okay. You've got lots of friends then. Yeah. You do. <laughs> and would you say you dress like a Gemini? Um, I think so, yeah. So, or I go over the top, like very trendy, yeah. or I go very minimal with uh, uh, pieces that, you know, stay in your wardrobe all the time. It depends on the mood. Brilliant. Well, I love your style. Cool. Thanks. <laughs> Funnily enough, Gemini's lucky colour happens to be yellow. I had a Gemini friend once who frequently came to work in yellow crocs. So yeah, Geminis and yellow seem to be a thing. Doing anything fun today? Um, just enjoying myself really. Today is the day all dedicated to me. Well, thank you so much for your time. No right. worry. Okay, bye bye. Thank you, have a good day. We're wearing monkey trousers from the sale, bit of mud on them, cardigan, <laughs> charity shop, coat, charity shop, top, charity shop, hat, accessorise. Oh wow, very cool. Thank you. <laughs> what have you got, Baba? Um, that's from TK Maxx. TK Maxx. That's just from Bershka, I think. Bershka. Uh, this jumper's from charity shop charity shop and that is Nike trainers and handmade tights yes <laughs> I made these tights myself Libra? is that, is that the star sign? Libra? Libra. I'm a Leo Leo would you say that you're dressing like your star sign? I have not a foggiest <laughs> <That's laughs> okay. not what a clue um I'm not entirely sure to be honest so you're a fire sign you're wearing red I'm a fire sign <laughs> So, there you go. The Libra lady, to be honest, doesn't really strike me as particularly Libra-esque. Whereas the Leo one definitely does give me Leo vibes. She even wears a jacket that's very similar to a jacket that JLo once wore. London has so many eye-catching things to offer, not just in terms of unique and fashionable people, but also its general landscape, its streets, architecture, landmarks, the things you see when window shopping. It's really quite remarkable. Take it in before I show you what I wore that particular day. Throw my outfit very quickly. So I'm wearing a really vibrant red coat, which is a vintage coat and it's kind of like a bouclet tweed fabric. I'm wearing this really vibrant orangey red oversized jumper by Lorette. It's very warm, very soft and cuddly. I love it. Then I'm wearing my high waisted Levi's trousers. These are by Edler and I like them a lot. Got them on eBay. Oh yeah, I got this one on Bestia Collective and it was only like 50 pounds, which I think is pretty good value for a really pretty vintage coat. So the bag is a really cute little find on Vinted. It's for leather in red and a four pearl handle, which I think is really cute. I like the size, it fits anything I want. I like to have my phone, my keys and that's it. Oh, and a mirror, just in case, you know, let's say you eat spinach, take out the mirror, check any spinach between your teeth? No? Great. Moving on with our day. Moving on with my earrings. So these are my favorite earrings of all times. These are actually the same or very similar to those that Blackpink Jenny wears in her solo music video. So they are by Simon Rocha. They are full pearl. I'm in love. I bought them on eBay and a pool bitch. I bought them for like 140 quid, which is still expensive. Yes, but thank you eBay. Yeah, I guess that's, that's all. Good morning, today is Sunday, I'm not going anywhere so I'm staying at home having a cozy day. I hope you got some style inspiration and enjoyed the video. Please consider subscribing, it would help my channel enormously. I'm trying to get to 1000 subscribers at the end of May, so fingers crossed we can reach that target which is very ambitious, but with your love and support we can do it. But yeah, I'll continue popping out new content for you every week and hope to see you again soon. Have a wonderful week ahead. Mwah.